Hey what's up guys Rana back here with another video and in this video guys I'm going to show you how you can write a SEO friendly article for your website so that your post and articles that are you writing for your website is going to come under the search results at least. So SEO friendly articles doesn't mean that your post or your articles going to rank number one on Google search results. But of course there is a most likely chance if your SEO better than your competitors then your post going to rank number one on Google search results. So if you're new to this channel I would like to let you know that we did a couple of videos on WordPress. We did video on how to get a free website and following that we did a video on how to get approval from Google AdSense for those free website. But now it's time to write a SEO friendly articles so that you can get at least some organic traffic for those free website and now you can earn money with those free website. So guys, you if you do not have website, you can create those free website by watching my other videos. You can find all those videos links in the description box of this video. So anyways enough talking and let me show you guys how you can write a SEO friendly articles. So I'm gonna go over my computer screen and let's get started. So as you can see guys now I'm inside the dashboard of my WordPress website. Now let me show you guys how you can write SEO friendly article for your blog or your website. So I'm gonna install the plugin and uh, that plugin gonna help us to write SEO friendly articles for our website. So let's go to the plugins. And then click on add new and now here we need to search the plugin Yoast SEO so guys this is the main plugin that we need to install make sure that do not install any other plugin because there are several other plugins available with the same name so don't get confused please install by team Yoast install this plugin and then click on activate and activate this plugin once you've done that this plugin will appear several locations on your dashboard as you can see it can be seen left hand side of your WordPress site if I scroll down you can see uh, the SEO button over here once you've done that it will ask you the configuration setup and that configuration setup is pretty simple you need to click on configuration button and then it will ask you the several questions about your website and about yourself answer those questions correctly and uh, you are good to go you are ready to write your articles let's go to the post and click on all post and let me show you and how this work so guys as you can see now it's also can be seen under the post section so guys as you can see this green dot indicates that this article is SEO friendly so this is the SEO score and this is the reliability score it can be fine if your reliability is okay but your SEO score must be good keep in mind that okay so let me show you how you can do exactly the same let's add a new post click on add new so here we need to enter the title of the post or article so I already prepared an article for you guys let me copy the title here and let me paste that title over here and next thing we need to do we need to scroll down and as you can see guys this Yoast SEO plugin also can be seen under the publish section okay if you scroll down you can see the Yoast SEO dashboard here and uh, if you keep scrolling down you can see the analysis this analysis tell us what to do what not to do so guys here's the main point here we need to do exactly this plugin tell us to do so we need to read these instructions and we need to follow them so let's go over here so guys here we need to write minimum 300 words I already prepared that as well so I'm gonna copy 
the 300 words and I'm gonna paste over here let's scroll down so guys as you can see now we did two good things and uh, two we need to do two improvements and uh, four are the problems detected by this plugin let's go on the top so we need to find or we need to consider the focus keyword let's copy the focus keyword let's say I wanna focus the Samsung Galaxy S9 then what I'm gonna do I'm gonna scroll down I'm gonna go to the Yoast SEO dashboard firstly I'm gonna paste that focus keyword here by doing that if you notice few things has been changed here as you can see now we did five good things here okay let's see what else we need to do it tell us the focus keyword does not appear in the first paragraph of the copy make sure the topic is clear immediately let's go to the top and let's add the focus keyword in first paragraph paste right there add comma and then space and uh, as you can see guys now it tell us your SEO is good but uh, let us do few more steps here and the next it tell us the focus keyword does not appear in the first paragraph sometime it does not show the real-time preview in that situation we need to save this article so guys let's scroll down and let's, let's see so guys as you can see we did uh, six good things and we need to improve three items here and we need to and uh, three problem has detected okay it says no meta description has been specified search engine will display the copy from the page instead if we do not write the meta description it will the search engine will show the meta description from the text over here okay let's write the meta description let me copy few text from there not let's just copy the text from there okay let's scroll down let's click on edit snipped I'm gonna paste the meta description here so guys matter your meta description should contain the focus keyword as you can see it is very important keep in mind that as well let's scroll down let's say what else left no image appear in the page consider adding some as appropriate so guys we need to add the image which is very important or you can add the featured image let's add the featured image here click on that you can click on upload you can upload the image so I'm gonna grab the image from my media library so guys make sure that your image alt text should contain the focus keyword so as you can see my this image has the alt text with focus keyword so once you done that click on set featured image and uh, now we did nine good things and we have only one problem it says no internal link appear in this page consider adding some as appropriate so in that situation we need to add few internal links internal links means add the URL of this same website just for demonstration select this text and click on insert slash edit link I'm gonna paste my website URL here I'm gonna click apply and this means whenever visitor of this article click on the design it will redirect that visitor to this link okay you can add the internal link to redirect your visitor to your another post which is very good practice to write a SEO friendly article okay so do that a step as well and let's scroll down let's see so we guys did 10 good things and we need to improve these 
lines okay next task we need to add the outbound link okay outbound link means outside link outside from your website that does not belongs to your website so which means whenever you writing your article you want to redirect your visitor to some other people's website let's say you wanna redirect your visitor to Samsung website then you wanna copy the same Galaxy S9 and then click on this link let's just type www dot samsung dot com slash apply that's it so this URL does not belongs to your site which means this is an outbound link if we scroll down so guys you can see we have only two things to improve the slug for this page is bit long consider shortering it okay we can do that too this is the slug okay and uh, this is from there to there is the slug we need to shorter this as well let's delete this one okay we good here let's scroll down so guys as you can see we did 11 good things here and if we scroll to the top we can see reliability needs to improve let's do this as well go to the reliability so guys as you can see it tell us the text does not contain any subheading okay let's add subheading inside this so I'm gonna change this text into subheading or heading okay we did that as well so guys important thing is that when you adding a subheading or heading your heading should have a focus keyword as you can see this heading has focus keyword let's go over here okay tell us to add uh, another subheading okay we can do that too this is another subheading let's go with four and uh, we are good here let's scroll down and let's see so guys that's fine if your reliability is good or not your SEO should be good okay and the next thing you want to do is you must need to add your post or articles any category of your website for example I'm gonna add this to my Android tips and tricks just for illustration and next make sure you do not add more than three or four tags so I'm gonna paste the tag here Samsung Galaxy S9 and uh, Android up coming phones then I'm gonna add uh, new and tried that's good okay 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 so guys let's quickly remind you what are the things we done here so guys we add the title here and your title should contain the focus keyword okay and then you wanna write the three minimum 300 words here and then you wanna add the internal links or external links and next you wanna add the media or image and your media and image should contain the alt text and that alt text should have focus keyword on it then you must add your articles under any category of your website and then please do not add too much tags in your articles and next if you scroll down you want to go to the Yoast SEO dashboard and here you need to do exactly the same as this plugin tells you to do you need to add the focus keyword first here and then you can click on edit snips and you wanna 
add the meta description and you can add the title here and let's add the title we forget to do that apologize for that let's copy the title and let's paste that title over here and we're done here as well and uh, as you can see the analysis says you did all the 12 good things and now your article is SEO friendly so guys thank you so much for watching this video guys if you learn something from this video you can give a like to this video and I will see you guys next time